So, right click anywhere and paste your sketch. Or you can import it from the same menu. You can rotate the image to any degree using this box. Resize the image by clicking on the image and stretching one of the points. You can hold shift to scale symmetrically. Now select the circle tool. Hold control for a symmetric circle. Click and place the circle at its place. By clicking and holding on the tools you can view hidden tools. Select pen tool and start creating lines by clicking on different places. Just follow the sketch outline. I am speeding up the process here to save some time. Connect the endpoints. Now select the shape tool. Click on the lines you just made. Right click on one segment of the line and select a curve. This turns the line segment into a curve which we can transform into desired shape. Click on the line segment to move it into desired shape. Right click on the connection point and click smooth to make the connection line smooth. Continue the same process. Likewise make inner line segments. Repeat the process again. Click and hold and select Smart Fill Tool. Click on the area we need. Select all areas by pressing and holding Shift key. To group two or more objects press Ctrl and G. Choose the thickness of the outline of the logo as desired from the right menu. If you can't find the menu to the side, 
Go to Window and Dockers and select Properties. Double click on the Rectangle tool to make a rectangle exactly as the size of the paper. By this technique the rectangle will always be in the lower layer. Behind every object. Select Fill option and choose Colors. Different choices gives you different types of results. Feel free to try other options. By clicking on the interactive tool you can choose the flow and shape of colors in the objects. Click on the Shadow tool to create a shadow of the objects. Play with Opacity and Feather option to fine-tune the desired look. And when you are done, just press Ctrl E to export in the desired format. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe.